Mm. Oh wow. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. What's up you guys? I am back! So in today's video we are doing the rotisserie chicken. Uh, this is also Be Love Life's uh, under $10 meal challenge. So I thought I would be doing that. Uh, also I won't be eating both chicken. I will pass one over to my fiance. But before we do that I'm gonna get uh, go ahead and do my thumbnail. Alright you guys I'm going to pass him his chicken. And we'll go ahead and eat. And this meal cost me under ten dollars. This chicken was like six dollars and some cucumbers. This is uh, per weight, so it didn't turn out that much. Maybe like a dollar or two. Uh, one lemon. And this uh, bill of sauce uh, I did way back. So, and I've kept it frozen, so it doesn't count like that. And a bag of rice for like two dollars. So yeah, everything is under ten dollars. I'm gonna go ahead and dig in because I haven't eaten and this is the first meal of the day so I'm excited mm. oh wow mm -mm -mm. Mm. I can't see myself, so if I have sauce, I'm sorry for that. Let's see. Mm. Damn. The lemon took it to a whole nother level. No kidding. This is so good. If only you guys could taste this. Oh my god. And this sauce takes it to the next level. Like, damn. Can I see my rice? <laughs> I also got some white cheese. I love to have white cheese with chicken. And in my country we eat uh, white cheese a lot as well. Wow. This is so perfect because I haven't eaten breakfast. And it's about 3.30. PM. So this meal is perfect. Wow. 
Uh, today we're drinking on some, let me see, lemon iced tea. So I'm gonna go ahead and pour this up in a Coca-Cola glass. I think this is from McDonald's. <laughs> you know, when you get those sometimes. Mm, that's so good. So yes, uh, it turned out that I got a cold as I, I talked about that in my last video <clears throat> and it did turn out that I was getting a cold and my fiance was right. So um, I've been feeling bad, you know, feeling sick and my nose been running and you know, I'm feeling tired and stuff like that. Oh wow. Make a lemon rain. I don't know it's if it's noticeable like that but I did um, buy two um, ring lights but like smaller ones so I am using those right now and I hope um, the lighting is better It makes me feel like a, you know, YouTuber, a content creator for y'all. Let's see. I'm devouring this chicken though. <laughs> Got the wing. I don't like to eat um, this pointy part, so I usually take that off. Some people like to um, eat the skin of the pointy part. But I don't. Uh, sorry. How y'all been doing? Let me know in the comments down below. Do you like to eat chicken? And do you eat your chicken with white cheese? I also like to have, um, if I don't have the sauce, I'll have white cheese and tomatoes. Oh Lord. That's some, some right there. <clears throat> I 
I like when the skin is crispy, but if it's not crispy and it comes off, I'm not gonna eat it. But if it's like crispy or like almost crispy and it stays on the chicken, I'll eat it. No, it's all in my mind. I'm not one of those uh, people who's scared to get dirty with my hands so I don't care if I eat with my hands or not. It's all good though. This challenge is actually really good because you know it can get really pricey sometimes when uh, when doing a mukbang video. I mean, I think the most I've spent on a mukbang video is about like sixty-five dollars, almost seven hundred crowns, and you know that's a lot for just one bit video and not even getting paid for the video, you know. If you are a um, new subscriber, welcome to the family. I really do ap appreciate you guys. And if you're an oldie, welcome back. I would really love if you would recommend this channel to like friends and family and help me grow. The faster I grow, the faster I can put out more content for you guys. Wow, this <coughs> chicken was really good with some lemon, like for real. If you haven't tried it, do it. I'm really excited about the lights because, you know, it makes me feel like it kind of motivates me in some in some ways so that's cool but in the future like <clears throat> when I move out I always talk with my fiance about having like a separate room for us to like build a studio because if you're an oldie, you probably know that my fiance does music. So, that would be really cool if we had like a separate room for the music and my YouTube. Like having a corner of the room where I can put up some, like a green screen and have my lights ready and my setup always like ready for me to just sit down and eat. And the other corner would be like his um, part of the room where he can put up his, you know, sound equipment and computer and stuff like that. So that would be cool. But that would be such an awesome uh, feeling, you know, because... Every time I record 
now like today present time uh, I have to get the food done and before I even start doing the food I have to um, set up my room and my fiance helps me like moving stuff around and um, putting the lights up and stuff like that so he does help me out which is really nice of him and then afterward I have to you know get ready with the food So today is Friday. Are you guys excited for the weekend? Having some free time if you doesn't <coughs> if you don't work. Some people do. So the weekend that we are going to my sister is finally here, <laughs> but I think we'll ce celebrate her either today or tomorrow and uh, I did some shopping and I think it was yesterday, even though I wasn't feeling so good, I still did one the shopping and what else I didn't know what to buy her so I bought um, like an outfit like a full outfit with like shirt and a jacket and pants and stuff like that so I hope she'll like that she loves uh, the movie Frozen but I couldn't find anything I did find like a frozen poster but like what is she supposed to do with that like come on I'm starting to get full Usually I start off with the wings and then the drumstick and the thigh but like because um, you know the fillet part always feels a bit dry to me but today mm -mm, I went in for the for that straight ahead the breast I think you call it the breast <coughs> I went in for that breast right away like I need to show you guys this like are you for real don't want it dripping everywhere <laughs> so I had some paper towel underneath <coughs> sorry sorry not sorry Mm -hmm. That sauce dripping everywhere. I love me some chicken, don't y'all? It works with everything you can put it in, like different stews, you can eat it by itself. It's all good to me. Come on now, got some lemon rain. Today I wasn't feeling like doing my makeup so I went with a simple look and also I bought these lashes from 
H&M for like I think it was like nine dollars I think like 80 or 90 crowns and I feel like they look so good I was feeling myself <laughs> I was in in the bathroom in front of the mirror <laughs> and I was doing like faces and talking to myself that was funny and sometimes it's like that with maybe your favorite shirt or outfit and stuff like that and it's important to like I feel like it's important to every now and then like spend time on yourself doing like if it's a skin routine or like if it's makeup or going out eating with some friends you know dressing up I feel like you have to do that sometimes my parents will be here in like two hours so I have to be done with this by then Sorry, but whoa I'm getting full like I am full I don't think I have I'll have this wing and then it's enough enough with the chicken at least <clears throat> in Sweden we have um, a day called Fettisdagen and it's basically a day when you're like allowed and excused to eat sweet stuff like cakes and candy and stuff like that and um, in Sweden, one tradition that they do have is they eat something called semla, and I will. And by the end of this video, I will have a semla and eat with you guys, so you'll see what it is. I'm done. Oops. I can't see the uh, rice because of the bowl. I'll be back okay you guys I'm back I just uh, cleaned up the food and this is a Swedish semla so it's basically a cake burger with vanilla cream and some whipped cream and you can have it in different flavors uh, not a lot of different f flavors but um, this is a traditional one and I also got some coffee because you know this is what you call a Swedish fika so I'm gonna go ahead and dig in because I usually take this part off and I scoop otherwise this is how it looks otherwise um, the cream will get everywhere Mm. Mm -hmm. Sorry if I'm slurping. The coffee's hot. 
So I did take a little, little break between eating and having this fika, as we call it, um, because I was super full from the food, so I can eat this at once. But I did. Um, I baked some muffins. Or cupcakes or whatever it's called. I did one with um, regular like vanilla and I did one with blueberries. <coughs> I haven't uh, tasted, tasted them but they look good. Definitely approved. Hold on, the phone is ringing. Okay, you guys, I'm back. The phone was ringing and my fiance was uh, at the bathroom. So there was no one here to answer the phone. And it kept, no! Well. And yeah, there's no one else at home. So um, I had to go and pick it up. a lot of cream there's a lot of cream on this and I can't even really like eat lactose and this has a lot of lactose in it on the cream and probably in the bun and everything. Mm -hmm. And that was that. So yeah you guys that was everything for today i hope that you enjoyed this video if you did please leave a big thumbs up on this video and also comment down below and don't forget to share this with your friends and help me grow and and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell next to the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any uploads so yeah without further ado i'll see you guys on monday bye